opening gate and through the freedom immersion. Uh, just a, a really wonderful woman. And it's good to have you here. Don, I'm just gonna I'm gonna ask you a, some questions here. Things that we've already talked about. I love even right now the presence of God here upon your face. Do you believe that in the beginning God made everything good and that he loves everyone? Yes, I do. Do you believe that because of humankind's choice that sin entered into our world and brought separation between us and God? Yes. And do you believe that God, not wanting us to be separated from him, that he sent his only son, Jesus Christ, born of Mary, a virgin, a, a real man, a real person, like we are all people, that, that Jesus lived a perfect life, that he died, and in his death that he took upon himself your sins and my sins and the sins of all of the world, and that when he was put into a grave almost 2,000 years ago, that the power of God came into that grave and raised him from the, from the, from the dead. Do you believe this? Do you believe that salvation is found in no other name but the name of Jesus Christ? Yes. And do you, be, do you believe because Jesus has become your Savior that he has a claim to your life? Yes. And do you agree that it is your desire that you would love God with all of your heart and with all of your soul, with all of your mind, and with all of your strength for the rest of your life? You believe that Jesus is coming back and that he will take you to be with him. Yes. And Donna, based upon your confession of faith, I'm going to baptize you in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. And as I do this, because you are under the Lordship of Jesus, as you enter this water and as you come out again, we are believing that in an even further and deeper way that the reality and the life of Jesus will be made known in your life. In the places where the enemy has tried to keep you from walking and living in your freedom and in the way that he has designed you, that resistance is going to be broken off in a new way. So Donna, I baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. So that as you've died with Christ, so also you may. 